One of the many benefits of playing in a bowl game is being able to have one last time together. That goes for everyone associated with the program, whether it's the freshmen, the scout team players, even the starters, of course. For Liberty, that includes some retro freshmen that made some big plays in our neck of the woods on Friday nights. Glenver's Kyle Hanks had the opportunity, like many of the others on the team, to travel out west here to Glendale, Arizona for the Verbo Fiesta Bowl. I had a chance to catch up with him just to see how his experience has gone thus far. I know you're still relatively young with the team, but the, this opportunity to even travel out here with these guys, man, how special is that for you? I mean, it's amazing. You know, I never thought I would even, you know, say I could come to a New Year's Six Bowl and it also be able to say, you know, I'm playing against Oregon. Like, I grew up, you know, dreaming about, like, playing Oregon or, you know, just watching their games and everything. So I, it's amazing to be out here. I love it. What have you learned the most in your time with Liberty so far? Like I said, it's, it's been a while since those Glimmer days, right? So what do you learn the most, man? Uh, just keep working hard every day. And then, you know, patience is key. You know, you got to wait your time. And uh, just keep putting in the work. You can't get down and stay up. If you had to describe Coach Chadwell in just a couple of words, what would that be, considering first year coach and getting you guys to the stage? Uh, he's been an amazing coach. I love him and uh, all the coaches he brought with him and uh, all the new coaches. They've been amazing this year. And, um, you know, they got us here. That's why we're here, because of them. You learn a lot from you guys, man. I mean, they teach you Jenga here, or, or you, you know, they learn, you know, learn a little bit more, right? Yeah. <laughs> What's the most fun thing you guys have done out here so far? I might have to say the, the Suns game we went to last night, going into, you know, Phoenix, seeing the city and everything. You know, that was my first NBA game, too, seeing D-Book and uh, Kevin Durant, so that was pretty cool. It's a dream come true not only for Hanks, but for the total of seven players that called Southwest Virginia home and that suited up to play high school football in our neck of the woods. Eric Johnson, 10 Sports.